first the mini 144 screens happening. For those of you who don't know, this is the print shop. The reason why you're watching this on 144's channel, I know it's like not quite drift related content, but the point of this story is we are finally going to create 144 gear. Um, we have a little site, 144racing.com. By the time you see this, all of this gear should be live. So I just thought it would be cool to kind of show you guys the process. And uh, here we are. We have a tour t-shirt. We have more of a like racing inspired gear. So that'll be on these to start. And today, on day number one, we're printing almost toast. So this is a six color graphic. So pretty sweet see the layers here and how this works is basically we print out our layers and we're gonna turn them into screens so I have one drying here so this is a layer as you can see so that's drying but basically I'll end up throwing it on the pat on the machine here and hand screening all the layers When I first went back to drifting, um, which was the end of 2018, I took my first lap with my fiance and uh, I just kind of get done driving and I'm like, what's the tire wear on the two runs? Almost toast. Really? <laughs> so anyways, that's where Almost Toast was born. This is a graphic that was uh, like a collaboration from my boy Diamond O'Brien who helps us out here at Rhythm for graphic design. He also does all the artwork for Most Pleasant Skateboards. He helped us with this Almost Toast graphic. It's like a retro toaster with tires coming out of it, of course, because you burn them up. So that's super cool. We also have our boy Austin here. Tell the people what's up. What's up? Oh. Caden's trying to flex out here. Oh my God. Kaden, we gotta get you on the gap. Oh, he's going the big kid. Oh, wow. That was almost the rolled ankle. You get the gap. Woo! He did it. He did it. What are you guys about to do in here? Cell phone. Go, throw it on there. Going. Going in. I got a I got all the screens made, so as you can see, boom, almost toast screens are made. Um, this is a six color front, six color back, uh, hand aligned. She's like a dinosaur. I'm gonna go ahead and throw color on all of these and get busy. <laughs> Hours later, still going. Dave, hold this. I'm gonna show the people the layers of ink. Step one, low t-shirt. First layer, light gray. Flash. Medium gray, layer two. Flash. Third layer, dark gray. Oh. Flash. Fifth layer. Some kind of custom sea foamy stuff we made. Flash. 
flash. Fifth layer, orange. Flash. Final, black. Got all the backs done. Time to start setting up for the fronts. So we got six colors on the toast. And then I gotta set up six more colors for the left chest. And here we have all of our screens. Kind of hard for y'all to see. I need a 195 is what I'm looking for. Got the graphic. Left chest is gonna be over here. All right, so talking a little bit about screen printing. So basically we're on the first stage. This is, uh, I have my screen. It has a layer of emulsion. I have my image. I'm gonna throw it in here and Burn it out now. Shut that. Lock. This is sucking up. And we're back. I know it's all getting blurry. Um, this will probably end up just being like a screen printing montage. Back graphics done. Moving on to the fronts. <laughs> Quick update. Um, yeah, everything's starting to fly by. I got the fronts done on the almost toast. Boom, fronts are done. I cleaned up everything here, spindles cleaned up, empty, ready for a new job. Got the endless search for tires up next. So it's gonna be a two color front. I'm gonna do gray and blue. Try to make it as light and as faded as I can. Like almost a little bit like unprofessional. So it's like old school, old school vibes. And on the back we have the whole tour. Fell already. Sweating. It's coming together. Super light coat, make it look faded, you know? Flash. Next color, blue. Comes out a little dull. Do a flash and another coat. Off she goes. Um, yesterday we got the front of the Endless Search for Tires done. Boom. So we have a super light gray hit on a poppy blue. And today I'm gonna screen the backs. First test print.
check the flash position. Still wet. Back to the flash. Next color. Last color. Then let's search for tires tour. First print. Can move that down. I think we're gonna roll with it. It's all blending together these days. So as you can tell, press is cleaned up again. Um, I got the back of these tour shirts done. This shit is my favorite, dude. Um, I haven't had this much fun screen printing in a while. So turn this down real quick. Radiohead trying to be all sad. Almost toast, done. Tour shirt, done. Next is track shirt. So this is gonna be uh, for our guys to wear, kind of like our official team gear when we go to Holly LS Fest. Um, and then obviously you guys can buy some of it also if you'd like. So for some of you who haven't seen screen printing, I'm trying to kind of throw in what I can on, along the way. It's super repetitive. So far we are on, today's Tuesday. No, today's Wednesday. We're on day three. So these they're taking me a little bit longer than I thought. On Friday, we're doing a photo shoot uh, with Austin and Caden so we can get this stuff on the site. So, uh, but yeah, it's all going good. Just gotta build out this track gear now and we'll go from there. The big name and number. But yeah, so there it is. It's kind of how a screen gets blasted out. As you can see, kind of the sky in the back, right? So we have emulsion, we have the mesh, we throw the emulsion on. Whatever like doesn't see light, the emulsion washes out. So in this case, the graphic washes out. So there you have it. And then down here, I just put a little bit of inspiration. It says, born in the rain, Industrial parks, late nights, day jobs, stay sideways. That's kind of uh, what we did when we were younger and I'm doing right now. I would have to screen print jobs, go drift. Come home, screen print jobs, go drift. Still doing it, I enjoy it. I'm excited to print for 144 and obviously it helps us continue to drift and keep going. So let's get to work, man. I gotta stop rambling. Caden's here. What's up? Austin's setting up. Sign number one. It's so cool. Proud. Proud. Caden helped me with the design on this one. I love this. The uh, infinity, Caden? Yeah. The endless. The endless. The endless. The endless. For tires, Next design. Almost tough. Base, and then we got the sparkle. Got them lined up. Look at that grassroots blue. The bowl is blue. Socks only. What happens, dude? What happens, man? All right, got the last. Uh, batch out of the oven here. 
Just finished up the endless search for tires, blue on blue. Um, thought I would take a second, talk to you guys about each t-shirt real quick. Start with this one. So this is obviously just the endless search for tires, uh, the track t-shirt. So concept behind this one is super simple. Um, trying to just let things like be super easy on the eye so you can tell that it's like a little bit of a ghost effect if you will flip this thing over so yeah on this uh, graphic here we did like a royal blue and then we did this little glitter uh, like a second glitter layer on just the 144s on here and in the front you guys are probably going to notice on the website it looks a little bit like blown out um, as you can tell it just kind of shimmers and whatever but in real life it's pretty cool in the sun it looks cool next up we have the almost toast so like i mentioned earlier this is a dedication to my dad um, this one was super fun to screen um, so you could see we have the dedicated to Blade. Um, for those who don't know, I think it was Hurt in a parking lot, maybe like five years ago, who uh, we were all chilling, having a beer, and he basically was like, your dad's like a razor blade. His, his name's Ray, whatever, razor blade. You guys get it? We did uh, this like vintage-y feel, so it's like orange, lime green, uh, light gray, medium gray, dark gray, and black. So, this one was fun, a lot of detail. Yeah, big graphic on the back. The front graphic. Um, growing up as a skateboarder, just basically left chest, big back was super common. This is just a classic t-shirt right here. And then we have the endless search for tires. So this t-shirt, I wanna run like all year. Um, depending on what you guys feel about the graphic, maybe we keep switching it up. But because we're on a grassroots tour, I want to make sure that I always have like a tour t-shirt going on. So check this one out. Uh, let's start with the front. Um, it was the Steel Wheels tour. If you know that, if your dad listened to that shit or whatever, classic rock, um, which is what my dad raised me on, we ended up running with that. So my buddy Caden, who's over there editing some photos for us, he helped me refine our own version. So this is the endless search for tires this is a super light gray hit so i tried my best to just like give it a vintage feel all of them are a little bit different like every pass was a little bit different so when you get the shirt maybe it won't look just like your buddies but that's kind of the point and uh it's on like this faded vintage shirt pretty cool move to the back and on the back again we uh, ran with that Rolling Stones. It's the same t-shirt, but Caden helped me out. We refined our own setup, so we have the American flag. We have uh, two tires that kind of create a cool symbol. The fucking phone's ringing. But yeah, like I was saying, so this is the back of the shirt. The Endless Search for Tires Tour. These are all the events we're gonna go to. Caden's also helping me do some internet things, some upload photo, to the site, upload man. to the site. The photo's ready. Dang. Let's see. Bam. Sick. That's something I should say. <laughs> so 144racing.com is the site. Uh, my mechanic Dave helped me set all that up. Later. Yeah. Thanks for your help. What's up, brother? Good shit. All right. Now get out. All right. I'm super excited to launch this website. Super excited to launch 144 as a brand. It's kind of been just something that honestly a lot of people ask about in the short term. I'm doing a grassroots tour. I'm drinking beer. I'm having fun. I have my dad, Dave, Corey, Caden, Austin. Like we have a good group of people here. I have my fiance. I get to get married this year. It's gonna be cool, man. So I just wanted to kind of connect with you guys and give you another just like outro or whatever but i've been working really hard in this shop for a long time stay tuned i'll see you guys soon someone's at the door
so I probably should go now. 